of breaking free of the constraints that society has placed on us, mostly women, for so long. And these, you know, these constraints are arbitrary, you know, rules and standards that have been enforced on us, like having to be thin or, you know, having a completely hair free body. And I want to help women feel good and confident in their own skin and their own bodies exactly as they are. But like, that doesn't mean that I'm against women uh, changing their bodies because I think it's incredibly important to have full body autonomy and also the means of self-expression whatever that might look like for you know for some people that might be makeup or even aesthetic body goals or shaving mm. and I think the distinction that I really try to make is to find out why that we do these things and is it to conform to this arbitrary standard placed on us on our shoulders by a society that profits from our insecurities or is it because we want to do something for us to feel more comfortable for self-expression or just because we want to so yeah I try and encourage people to explore their why and the reasoning behind it and even if it does even if your reasoning is conforming to societal standard like that's okay too but I think that acknowledging it and talking about it allows you to explore it and eventually potentially explore your own true desires as well if any of that makes sense <laughs> it's a long makes tons of sense. it makes sense so you're so on brand for the happy vagina this idea of um, autonomy actually, and having agency over our own choices, but making sure that we've dug deep and understand why we're making them and whether or not we're making them yeah. for the right reasons and whether or not we are honouring our highest goddess within the decision.